Well, hello and welcome back to another video. Are you really humming? Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> My wife is in the background and she's humming. <laughs> Welcome to another video here on my channel. I have a very special and different kind of video for you guys. Whoa, for you guys. So, as you guys can see, there is a lot of clothes here surrounding a beautiful, beautiful preemie baby. And if you follow me on Patreon, you guys already know about this baby. You guys have actually known for some time. I've just delayed my presentation. Um, you guys knew about the baby, but none of you guys have seen her haul, which is what you guys are looking at. And I will go uh, piece by piece and share with you guys what I have bought for this baby. But uh, yeah, so I've had her for at least two months. Yeah. Two months. My wife is very disappointed in me. So my wife, I guess I should give you guys a little backstory to this little girl. And as I talk about her, I'm going to share some cute little moments that I've had with her here in a smaller screen. But anyway, my wife received this baby as part of a tray. Uh -huh. Trade. I said tray. <laughs> Trade. And she was painting this baby, working on it, and I thought this baby was cute. And you know, before paint, I thought this baby was adorable. And after paint, I thought this baby was so incredibly real looking. And um, I don't know, I just got very excited. My mom, my mom, <laughs> my <laughs> wife. <laughs> I'm obviously thinking about my mom. <laughs> my wife told me, um, oh no, no, I forgot what I was gonna say. But I, uh, I asked my wife if I could have it. Have it? I know, that's crazy, right? Like what? You want this doll? Oh, in which, by the way, this doll is a, a full body preemie silicone baby. And she, I, as I told her, oh my God, can I have it? I realized that my question was really crazy. <laughs> and I should probably not expect a yes, but she told me yes. She really does love me, guys. I said, <laughs> if you make videos, and she's like, yeah, I'll make videos. Oh, yes, and that's right. And then she right. went and bought all these clothes and did nothing. Okay. <laughs> and the truth comes out. So she said yes. I got very excited. I don't know where we were that I bought all these clothes. We went to the Walmart in Singer. Okay, so we went to a different Walmart. Mm -hmm. And got I got all these preemie outfits there. And then I just sat them on my kitchen <laughs> table chair and that's the end of that <laughs> until today <laughs> where the baby was too <laughs> and i just like i was trying to tell my wife i was not having good couple months um so she you know for her she's just like oh yeah whatever uh, just I've, routine with other dolls so, so anyway i've been feeling a lot <laughs> better and we have a baby so Please welcome my baby girl. I haven't named her um, yet. I think you're gonna call her Billy. Oh, that's right. I have an aunt named Billy. I said I was gonna name her Billy because technically this doll is a boy. So he's anatomically correct uh, as a boy. But since we will not be sharing any of that stuff yep. here on my channel, I thought, you know, it doesn't hurt to make the baby as a girl. And the reason why I decided to make the baby as a girl or make a, the baby a girl is because there's just, if you guys can see, there's so many adorable girl things. And it's preemie. It's all preemie. So I, I, I ran the idea across with my wife and she, she liked the idea. So, I decided to give her a very gender, gender neutral name, and I really love the name Billy. Billy can be boy or girl, so there might be times you guys will see Billy dressed as a boy, and there will be times that you will see Billy dressed as a girl. Just because we're not having her, uh, the doll be gender specific because you'll never see its private parts. Exactly. So I was telling my wife that my the doll will be non-gender specific, so it'll be boy or girl, and the name will be Billy. So Billy will be whatever Billy feels 
So I hope that is okay with everybody. I hope we can just love and enjoy the doll and the art for what it is and not focus on the gender. Just, you know, just enjoy the cute baby clothes, enjoy the cute baby doll and share, you know, share our hobby with everybody. So with that being said, Billy has been wearing this outfit for the last two months. And I do think it's time to change Billy. But before we get to that, I want to share with you guys what I picked up for Billy a couple months ago. <laughs> so, some of these onesie sets that you guys see here, I was able to find accessories for. So, for example, this hat here matches these onesies. And then I got really, really lucky with this onesie set, actually. So, I'll just go ahead and get started here. So I got lucky because I was able to find, well, my wife helped me as well, mittens and a hat set. And it's Gerber and it's, uh, what's this? This this is a newborn size, but I do think it'll fit Billy. So, yeah. um, and then the mittens are zero to three, but I do think that she will oh, be right. able to wear them. So let's just get started with the cute onesie set. So it's Gerber and like I said, it's creamy size so you see um, I think this is a girl bear hugging a little bunny and then you have that same print in a white onesie uh, but all over the onesie and then you have this polka dot navy blue onesie obviously this print is somewhere like a different outfit or something it might match with like this one because the bear oh. has blue in her bow but uh -huh. I mean yeah. Okay. They yeah. Do so, that sometimes. so these are the the like I said the mittens and then the hats. I always throw in something random. So this was the only one that I was able to find everything for, and then I got this child of mine Carter's onesie set, and I really like it mainly for the middle onesie. I think it's very common that when it comes to onesie packs, all of us tend to just like one or two. Uh -huh, yeah. We don't like all of the onesies from the onesie set. So this is so cute. It says the princess has arrived and you have a little castle and then you have the, so this is the onesie that won my heart. And of course you can't just buy the one onesie. We have the little unicorns, uh, castles and the princess and tiny little hearts. And then we have all these uh, oh, at first I thought they were hearts, but they're not. So polka dot, polka dot, golden polka dots, I should say, glittery. Very, very glittery. So that is um, one of the uh, onesie packs that I got for her. And uh, I'm going to move on to this other onesie pack. It's also Carter's Child of Mine. Also bought it at Walmart. And I was lucky with this one. I was able to find the mitten set but no hat sets there might not be any hat sets for this one so this one is super cute i think we always tend to see the classical owl every yeah. year we oh there's always like owls one thing, i'm getting tired of seeing that owl uh, i remember when we first started uh, the hobby everybody was into the owls remember honey yeah because it was mint green like that and then a black onesie with white polka dots and a mint green bow so cute yeah. so crazy how i can remember that. <laughs> but <laughs> you are just so good with your baby clothes okay so here is a Gerber onesie set and I was able to find the hat for that so let's get let's look at the onesies first we have a pink giraffe an elephant and a cute little blue bird on top of the elephant then we have that same image spread all over a white onesie and then we have the pink giraffe print and that goes with these so now we're gonna look at this one. Oh my gosh this one is so cute this one is koala baby so I got this at babies R Us, and I think we got this before we knew babies R Us was closing this is so cute all these popsicles with golden glitter and flowers I don't know it's just so adorable and then we have another popsicle on a pink onesie and it says cutie. So there's four onesies here. This is the third one with an elephant and it says I love you. And the fourth one is 
this striped onesie so white and flower stripes if that makes any sense this here is actually a three-piece set that i got from walmart and it has a onesie missing because that's the onesie that she's currently wearing with the mittens um, to match the mittens so those mittens were in here oh my gosh how cute i cannot say no to cat stuff cat stuff is so adorable and this is the second onesie with the hot pink and more lighter color cats all over the onesie. And then I believe this is just a polka dot, like highlighter pink onesie. So cute. And of course, this is a third onesie, Mommy's Cutie. And then the last onesie set that I have is another Gerber. This one is so cute. I wasn't able to find anything for it. I don't know if any accessories exist for this one, but you have a baby blue onesie with the word sweet and then a flower print onesie. I love this oh, one. Really cute. I think this is the reason why I got this outfit set because come on, that one is a, so adorable. And then it just has a, a regular white and pink striped oh, onesie. Do you have like a white hat in Mittens will go with that. Yeah, of course. So those were all the onesies. Now we're gonna look at the sleepers. Oh, I you got can do this pink hat. Oh yeah. And mittens. Yeah, there you go. We can use that shot. This pink hat and mittens to mm -hmm. match with you get to see the stuff color. right there. So I got they had other sleepers, you guys, but I'm the type that I only buy it if I really, really, really like it. Because if I don't like it, I will not put it on my doll. And I just feel like that's a waste of money, right? So I'm gonna only buy it if I really like it because I know that my doll will wear it. So I'll show you guys this creamy sleeper. This one I also got at Walmart and it's so cute. I love how vibrant and spring it is and um, it's just so adorable. I love the yellow with the pink. Love this little bee. I love that it's not like black stripes. They actually used um, like a gray, gray string and they just sewed in the stripes. I don't know, it just makes it more subtle. It's not so bam in your face. <laughs> I like that a lot. So then I have this other sleeper that says little sister. I thought that was very appropriate for her um, because she's so tiny. So, and then you just have all these hearts printed all over the sleeper. So cute. And then we have, uh, I think we have two more sleepers. One is the unicorn. Of course she has to have something unicorn because everybody else does in this house so she has her own unicorn sleeper and we got this one at walmart and then the last sleeper is this one it's like a hot pink color and it has white polka dots with these cute little hearts that are made out of flower print material and then you can see that on the edge of the sleeve or it's trimmed the sleeves are trimmed and the collar is trimmed and then, oh, I like, I never noticed that the bottom of the foot also has that same print. That's so cute. And then, okay, so then we went to Target and I looked at the stuff that, stuff that they have there and, and I saw this cute preemie gown there. And I, I love it. So the print on this gown is just flowers all throughout the gown. And then it comes with a hat and some little booties. And to put it on the baby, there's you have to use the little snaps. So cute, and it has the built-in mittens. And then let's see, at Target I also saw this lamb outfit. So adorable, they always seem to have this style of clothing for preemies available it's it's always a different design but it's the same concept you have a little t-shirt with built-in mittens then you have your pants that have the little footies oh my gosh how cute is that and then of course the onesie this one says 
Mommy's Happy Girl. Now that I notice, so the, this onesie set that I showed you guys earlier, that does have pants, little pants. So we can combine these onesies with either this magenta, uh, these magenta pants, and they're roughly at the butt. And then there's these golden polka dot ones, and then a hot pink pair. And then I also have these child of mine ones that I picked up at Walmart. I'm sure these had a purpose with one of these onesie sets, but I can't exactly remember. No, they didn't match anything. They didn't match anything? We just grabbed no, them? No, well, they did match. They can go with these. Oh, they I can go with different stuff like that, too. Okay, I think that's why we got them. They weren't specific to one thing. Um, I think I shared you. I shared everything with you guys. Oh, that was fast. That was fast. So, Little Miss Billy will have a changing video following up. I hope you guys um, have enjoyed this haul. I want to thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. And Little Miss Billy and I will see you in a following video. Bye.